Welcome to part two of our gender fluid, my way, explaining what the hell is going on with Robert Lagerman and why won't he blink his goddamn freaking eyeballs. It's not normal for someone to go this long without blinking, don't you think? Maybe he's crazy. Or maybe I've just figured out that gender is meaningless and that to express yourself as a human being can take all forms. Gender really doesn't mean jack shit. And gender should not come into play with determining if one human is allowed to see oh I have to suck my belly because I have body which she is my breasts aren't big enough so tomorrow I'm going to start estrogen injections to make these puppies bigger for you but onwards with the show we had just entered the DFS. Let's see what happened, shall we? Welcome to part two. All right, so I think that meeting went rather well. Um, the DFS is now going to follow up with all the concerns and issues that I raised around the marital home and the safety of the children in their home. Start cleaning. I had to cut that last part out because I can't say my wife's name. I'm on my way to Fred Astaire, where I shall dance to Frank Sinatra. born, 14 years old. Last summer, I, um, I took him to a soccer game and uh, he, uh, they, I, I think that they uh, didn't do as well as, uh, as he wanted. So um, to cheer him up, I bought him a soda, an uncaffeinated soda, it was a Sprite. When my wife found out about that, Jesus, you have no idea how controlling this person is. I mean, the argument lasted about an hour about how I did this, how I bought my son a soda. 
with sugar in it, no caffeine. And as a good husband, I apologized and promised I would never do it again. Do you have any idea how liberating, how goddamn fucking liberating it is to be free of control like that? Huh? Now I apply my discipline and my control to other things. Watch me dance. my day so far and you know how I do it it's called anarchy do another blog, daily blog tomorrow and I will look slightly different because believe it or not I am going to see my endocrinologist for my estrogen injection tomorrow to transition from male to female at the transgender clinic at Middlesex Hospital in Middletown, Connecticut I'm also meeting with my psychologist there, I have like five psychologists at this point for various ailments People keep telling me I need to seek mental help, so I keep seeking them, and they keep um, agreeing with me. It's very strange. But all these amateur um, psychologists out there, like Dr. Von Miller, um, think that I need even more help. So, as you saw in the uh, Clockwork Orange, Clockwork, Clockwork Loggerman video, which Facebook has taken, uh, which YouTube has taken down for copyright infringement of the intro music. Uh, they are so sensitive to copyright, but I'm appealing that and I'm putting that back on. But if you saw that video, then you'll see that uh, they want me to see yet another a new psychiatrist in New York City at Presbyterian Hospital. So I'm going to go to Presbyterian Hospital and I'm going to say, 
I believe in Jesus Christ and I believe that Mother Mary um, had um, uh, a pregnancy initiated by a ghost and after she gave birth to a baby boy her hymen was intact and we should eat this baby boy ritually cannibalistically uh, every Sunday and drink his blood and it will magically turn into wine uh, and then the baby boy will be alive um, and walk around and talk to people and that is not considered mental illness by the Presbyterian Hospital uh, but putting a dildo in my mouth do you know how much sex toys are sold? 1.5 billion dollars that's the uh, market for sex toys in the United States the market for mayonnaise is only 1.3 million dollars but if I made a video where I put some mayonnaise maybe I make a BLT or something and I put that in my mouth then everyone would say hey Lagerman made a video about how to make a mayonnaise BLT but if I go to that larger market of dildos and I put a fucking dildo in my mouth everyone says I'm mentally ill maybe I should drink some more blood of baby Jesus but then again it would turn into wine and I don't drink wine getting my nipple done <laughs> I'm doing it my way. Thank you. No problem. Want to see this up close? Yeah, let's see. And wow. real personal. And that is how one does it. Robert Lagerman's this way. And here I am at home. I've got one more thing I want to show you. Uh, so, I stopped at um, a truck stop on the way. And uh, I got something I really want to show it to you. I think you're going to like it. Oops. I think you'll be quite surprised. Can you go keys? Give me just one second. Um, this is the tunnel of eternity, remember? I just had a phone call that someone's coming over. So I wanted to make myself look ready for them. So, this is how I shall greet them. Do you think they'll like me like this? Mm. Should I do a little dance for you? Much more, much more, much more than this. I'm doing it. I'm doing it my way. I love you all. And I hope that you are all as content with who you are as I am with who I am.